An out of sorts to lose welcomed Santa Chen to the stadium, who hadn't lost in their last four. Christophe Galtier's men had the opportunity to move up to fifth. Toulouse's form, however, had seen them slide down to tenth. Pascal Dupraz looking for his first win in 2017 and a change in fortunes. First chance of the match went the home side's way. Free kick for Toulouse, good strike by Jimmy Durmaz. But Jesse Moulin was there to parry. Just before the 10 minutes mark, Saint Etienne get the first penalty of the match. Captain Loic Perra plays long ball forwards. Romain Hamouma runs through on goal, but it's clipped by Alban Lafont, and the referee awards the spot kick. The replay show there is minimal contact, but nonetheless contact. Hamouma clipped at the ankle by Lafont. Nolan Roux steps up and Saint Etienne's highest goal scorer last season makes no mistake with the finish. 1 0 for the men in green. Saint Etienne almost make it 2 just before the break. Kevin Monet Pake took advantage of slack defending to play in Romain Hamouma. Lafont saved the first effort and the follow up by Roux was brilliantly blocked by Issa Diop. Good save by the keeper and an even better block by the defender. Saint Etienne 1 0 up at half time thanks to Roux's penalty. Plenty of chances on either side, but both teams unable to finish off their opportunities. Toulouse needing to be a lot more aggressive after the break if they wanted to get anything out of this match. Matters got worse for Toulouse after the restart when Wergington Somalia was sent off for a dangerous tackle on Jordan Veretou. The Toulouse man seemed like he played the ball, but the referee thought it warranted a red card. And Toulouse down to 10 men. The extra man advantage took its toll. Eight minutes later, Saint Etienne went two goals up. Florentin Pogba crosses the ball in from the left, and Monet Paquet is there to head in. Only his second goal of the season but this one pretty much guaranteeing the win for his team. It's a good header. And Lafont, no chance with that. Stelouz then had a glorious chance to get a foot back in the match, but once again their accuracy let them down. Martin Braithwaite got his header to the cross, but his effort hit the bar and Saint Etienne managed to clear. After 67 minutes, Toulouse were handed the hammer blow when young defender Kelvin Amian held back Hamouma in the box and the referee had no option but to award another penalty. A mistake that you can put down to youth and inexperience, but nonetheless a stonewall penalty. Once again, Roux stepped up and converted his second goal of the afternoon, his fourth of the season. Toulouse nil, saint Etienne three. The game done and dusted, with Galtier's men now up to fifth in the table, and Toulouse's horrible run now goes on to five consecutive losses.